More than likely, I'll take uh, all the next year off and, uh, and then just see what happens. If, if some things come up that uh, I really want to do, I'll do them. George Strait is an American country music singer, music producer, and actor. He's considered one of the most popular recording artists of all time. Unlike many of his contemporaries, George Strait made sure to stick to the traditional elements of country music and inspired others to move away from the pop-infused sounds that became popular during the 80s. Of all his albums, 13 have reached multi-platinum status, including the eight times platinum Pure Country, while a further 33 have achieved platinum status. In the 2000s, he was inducted into the Country Music Hall of Fame. Strait has also won 22 CMA awards. And it's nostalgic too, you know, and especially since we're doing so many old things in the show now. You know, we're doing songs that I haven't done in some of them 20 years. If you enjoy these videos, please remember to hit the like button as it does help us out a lot. And comment below who your favorite celebrity is that you'd love to see in an upcoming video. His full name is George Harvey Strait Sr., but is also known as King George, GS, the King of Country. He was born May 18, 1952 in Poteet, Texas, making him 69 at the time of this production. He stands at 1.77 meters or 5 feet 9 inches tall. George Strait is a spokesperson for Wrangler Jeans, partnering with them to raise awareness for their National Patriot Program. The initiative aims to raise money for American veterans and their families, focusing on the fallen or those who've been wounded in action. He was also named Texan of the Year in 2018 by Texas Legislative Conference. May 18th is George Strait Day in Texas. He enjoys various outdoor activities like hunting, fishing, playing golf, riding motorcycles, etc. He's associated with the Wrangler National Patriot Program, a campaign that raises awareness and funds for America's wounded and fallen military veterans and their families. Strait is a cousin of Amazon founder Jeff Bezos. Strait's being honored for his fundraising efforts in the wake of the widespread flooding following Hurricane Harvey. George Strait often records in a tiny studio in Key West owned by Jimmy Buffett. Strait, along with a longtime friend and business partner, Tom Cusick, created the Vaqueros Del Mar Invitational Golf Tournament and Concert, held annually at Strait and Cusick's Texas Hill Country Resort, Tapatio Springs Resort, near Bourne, Texas. The Invitational raises money for David Faherty's Troops First Foundation, benefiting wounded servicemen, service women, and their families. Strait married his high school sweetheart, Norma, in 1971. Together, they had two children. Their first child, Jennifer, was born October 6, 1972. Their son, George Strait Jr., known as Bubba, was born in 1981. Their daughter was killed in a car accident in 1986, prompting George to start the Jennifer Lynn Strait Foundation, a children's charity. In February 2012, Strait became a grandfather when George Strait Jr. and his wife, Tamara, had their first child, a son, George Harvey Strait III. I'm like, I don't know if I can, you know, I can go back out next year. You know, this is like killing me. Just the, just the constant travel. And he was born to John Byron Strait Sr. and Doris Jean Coaster. Raised alongside two siblings on a 2,000-acre cattle ranch owned by his father in Pearsall, George was working with animals and doing farm work from a very early age. When he was in grade four, his parents divorced. Strait first became interested in music during his high school days and joined a rock and roll band with other students. Although he was initially drawn in by bands like the Beatles, he quickly fell in love with country artists such as Hank Thompson, Lefty Frizzell, and Merle Haggard. He regularly attended live performances by country artists across Texas. After graduating high school, he enlisted in the Army and was stationed in Hawaii. Once there, he joined an Army-sanctioned country band and welcomed his first child into the world with his wife, Norma. He spent a total of four years in the Army and reached the rank of corporal. After his honorable discharge, he pursued post-secondary education at Southwest Texas State, eventually graduating with a degree in agriculture. While serving in the Army, he was stationed in Hawaii, where he began performing with an Army-sponsored band named Rambling Country, which also performed off-base under the name Santee. Later on, while pursuing his college degree, he joined the country band Stony Ridge as a vocalist. 
He soon became the leader of the band and renamed it as Ace in the Hole. His band performed all around South and Central Texas and gained local followers. Soon, Strait got the opportunity to record many of the songs he'd written, but these songs could not achieve wide recognition. After years of struggle, Strait finally signed a solo contract with MCA Records in 1981 with the help of his friend Irv Woolsey. In the same year, he released his first single, Unwound, which became one of the top 10 hot country songs. The song was included in his debut album, Straight Country. In 1982, Strait followed up with a second album called Straight From The Heart, which featured his first number one single, Fool Hearted Memory. During this period, he started to perform at live shows for the first time. He finished the 80s with a number of well-received albums before branching out with different sounds in the critically acclaimed 1990 album, Living It Up. After releasing the album, Holding My Own, he starred in the box office bomb, Pure Country. After releasing many more high-performing albums, Strait founded the George Strait Country Music Festival in 1997. The festival would repeat for the next four years, and Strait performed alongside some of the biggest names in country music. During this period, he released the album Always Never the Same in 1999. In the late 2010s, he released albums such as Cold Beer Conversation and Honky Tonk Time Machine. You know, 200 dates in a year. You know, you, you go out not, not really expecting that. And then you get to uh, on about that hundred and some odd. Strait's one of the best-selling artists of all time, having sold more than 100 million records worldwide. Overall, Strait's the 12th best-selling artist in U.S. history. He's also partnered with Justin Boots, Resistall, a brand that makes cowboy hats, Garia, a Danish manufacturer of luxury golf carts, and Codigo Tequila. George Strait was quite innovative when it came to his tours. He created a 360-degree theater-in-the-round approach to concerts that allowed more viewers to attend. This festival approach was also commercially successful, and George raked in $99 million in just three years during the Strait tours. Strait often earned significant amounts of money despite relatively few tour dates. For example, he earned $15 million in 2005 with a tour that had only 18 shows. He has a net worth of $300 million. The king of country reportedly has multiple properties in Texas. The family ranch he was raised on in Pearsall, Texas, has been in the Strait family for over 100 years, while he spends a lot of time at another ranch near Catula. He owned a ranch in San Antonio, Texas. The 7,925-foot square house sits on a hilltop surrounded by 12 very private acres and is priced at $7.5 million. Sitting on more than 12 acres, the four-bedroom, eight-bathroom abode was designed and custom-built for Mr. Strait and his wife, Norma, by the late Arizona-based sculptor and architect, Bill Toll. The home features 14 custom fireplaces, exposed ceiling beams, hand-plastered walls, stained glass windows, yellow pine hardwood floors, and a copper top bar designed by Toll. The house was sold in December 2021. He likely owns the following cars, a Bentley Continental GTC, A Garia Luxury Golf Cart. A Rolls Royce. Strait owns a Gulfstream G450 business jet and carries a personal registration 
N518GS.